northern Wales, northwest England, some heavy persistent rain here, but it's across Scotland where that rain is just turning heavier and more persistent through the next few hours and indeed for the next 24 hours. We've got a Met Office amber warning in force and the reason for that is increasing risk of surface water flooding across central eastern Scotland and as we go through the next 36 hours, river flooding could become a problem as well. Just watch how the rain band stays in place through tonight, still remaining wet across parts of northern England and Wales too, always a little bit dry further south and east where we'll still see some partly clear skies but cloud amount will gradually increase and for all not a desperately chilly night temperatures around 12 to 15 but into Thursday morning whilst the far north of Scotland will be brighter than we've seen through today still a cold easterly wind and still that rain in place particularly through central and eastern parts we're thinking about uh, the parts of uh, Perth and Kinross also Stirling where the greatest risk of flooding will be there will be some mist and low cloud across many coasts and hills in the west the rain in Northern Ireland light and patchy but some heavier bursts of rain across Northern England the Midlands Wales and the southwest at this stage the southeast largely dry could be a bit of morning brightness but some heavy downpours pushing through here during the middle part of the day before clearing and then really for the afternoon we see skies brighten a little bit still a lot of cloud one or two brighter spells lifting temperatures to around 22 if you do see the sunshine but no still raining across parts of southern Scotland and northern England. Now that rain will ease off as we go through Thursday night. Light and patchy rain here and there on Friday but the rain turns heavier again in Northern Ireland later in the day and that will sweep across all parts to take us into the start of the weekend but leave us with a story of sunshine and showers. More sunshine I think on Sunday. If you're worried about weather warnings and indeed flood warnings check out the latest on the website and of course on see